Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video I have a attempting to do a Goose Creek versus Bath and Body Works. So what I have done is I have tried to match up as close as I can to Goose Creek and Bath and Body Works candles. So of course they're not going to be completely matching. That's two separate companies, two separate everything, right? So I tried to match up as close as I could to the scent notes with the matching pair with uh, both companies because uh, Goose Creek did just release like an ice cream slash dessert type of line just recently and Bath and Body Works, you know, they did too. There's like the cereal ones together. So I was like, that's what inspired my idea. I saw both of them had cereals out. So I was like, let's compare the two. Again, guys, they're not going to be perfectly matched. So do not get angry because they're two separate companies. They're not dupes for each other. I'm just doing verses of each other, you know? I didn't also did not want to pick up every single candle. I just did the best that I could and the ones I wanted. I didn't want to pick up candles I didn't want just to, you know, verse them. Let's get in right into the video. All right, guys, we're going to open this Goose Creek package together. I hope nothing is broken. Let's see. Ooh, 15% off coupon. By the way, they have a great reward system at Goose Creek. Now the moment of truth. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, we're good. Hi, double chin. Oh, what? Oh, the lids are in there. I was like, where the heck are my lids? Okay, second one. Oh, 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 oh. Why are the lids stuck in here? Okay, nothing is cracked. I'm gonna turn you guys around and show you guys everything. I just opened this box as you guys saw. I haven't seen the candles myself. I haven't smelled any yet. Actually, that's a good idea. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna haul the Goose Creek candles first and then do the verses later. I'll put it in timestamp if you guys just wanna skip to the verses. But if not, just continue watching where I'm gonna smell the candles first with cold, see how it smells. Okay, let's start, I'm gonna randomly pick them out. First one, what is this? Key Lime Cake Pop. Ooh, look at that color. It is a neon, neon green color. Ooh, okay. So Key Lime Cake Pop. Mm, yep, this smells just like Key Lime. There is a Bath & Body Works candle for this and I have it. Oh, I think I finished it actually. The actual Bath & Body Works Key Lime candle. It came out maybe like two years ago, three years ago. Oh, this is a dupe for it. This one is a little softer. I think the Bath & Body Works one is a little bit more stronger. I definitely smell the graham cracker in this. Let me pull up the notes so I can see exactly what's in this because they're not on the bottom of the jar. The scent notes are juicy lime, cake batter, vanilla icing, and a sparkling sugar. Hmm, I, I don't know where I smelled graham cracker from, but I smell graham cracker. I definitely smell the lime. I smell, this smells really good. If you guys like the key lime candle from Bath & Body Works, this is definitely a dupe for it. Next one, what's this? Ooh, I for, oh, I forgot about this. They also had destination candles, and so I picked up, I think, one or two of the destinations one. This is Grease and it's Santorini Sunset. So it looks like this. I'm gonna try and smell it first and not look at the scent notes to see if I can figure it out. Whoa. By the way, a little disclaimer. The thing with uh, Goose Creek is on cold, I have noticed that their scents can be softer. However, once you light it, the throw, it is hit or miss. But the throw is sometimes insane. So you can't judge Goose Creek based off of cold because their throw, once the wax melts and the warmness and the chemicals, whatever happens, their throw is pretty darn good. I will have to say that. So off the bat, off cold, a lot of them do smell weak, but don't judge them until you light them. Again, they are hit and miss though. So not all candles are like that, but this one for me right now is really weak. I can't smell much. It smells very clean. Scent notes for Greece are juicy pineapple, orange, coconut, and sweet hibiscus. I was way off. I smell the sweet hibiscus, but I don't smell pineapple, orange, or coconut. It's really, really, really weak. But again, I'm not gonna judge it until I light it. It does smell good. It's just too weak. Next one, ooh. So this is Cocoa Crisps. Now, it doesn't smell bad, but it's not what I was expecting. I was expecting to open this and smell cookie crisp, like cookies or chocolate or some type of cereal. 
It's way, way, way too light. I don't smell anything. I smell something sweet, but I can't place maybe like a vanilla. So the scent notes are mint chocolate, cookie pieces, cocoa, vanilla, and powdered sugar. Yeah. All I get from this is vanilla. I'm not smelling anything cookie related. I'm not smelling anything chocolate related. Um, this one's another candle where you, I'm assuming I have to light it up to actually smell it because I'm not getting anything right now. But I'm not giving up on it. Like I said, don't judge Goose Creek on cold. Ooh, another one from their ice cream collection. So this one is Banana Marshmallow. I don't think Bath & Body Works has anything to compete with banana and marshmallow. So let me see. Ooh, look at that packaging. I'm excited for this. This one smells, I can finally smell something. Okay, 100% smell the banana. I smell the marshmallow, oh my God, I love this one. I love this one. I can actually smell the banana and the marshmallow. Hold on, how? It smells like, a, think of like a marshmallow ice cream. Think of a banana split. Okay, it smells like a banana split with, and the ice creams are marshmallow, if that makes any sense. Oh my God. 100% smells like banana marshmallow. Let me look at the scent notes on this. It is creamy ice cream, fluffy marshmallows, banana, and vanilla. Yeah, it, they, they, they hit this on the nail. It smells just like banana and marshmallow to me. Oh my God, I'm so excited to like this one. It smells so good. I didn't even know bananas and marshmallows would go together, but I like this one. Next one. Ooh, another ice cream on a birthday cake. All right. I have had a couple of their birthday cake, cake pop candles before. They have been pretty weak, especially their Easter collection. There was a lot of like cake related candles in there. And to me, they were pretty weak. I don't have much expectations for this one, but I'm hoping for goodness. So it just says birthday cake on it. Oh, interesting. Vanilla, possibly like the lightest, lightest, lightest cake batter. Let me look at the scent notes for this. It's creamy ice cream, birthday cake, vanilla, bean, and icing. So yeah, I definitely pick up vanilla and cake batter, I would say. But it smells good. It's a very pleasant smell. It's, it is cake batter and vanilla. What is this? Ooh, peanut butter crisps. I'm excited for this. So I don't think Bath & Body Works. They did have a PB&J candle like two years ago, but they haven't released anything peanut butter related. So I don't think this could be compared to anything, but peanut butter crisps. Oh, the candle is cracked. This smells like a very, think of a Reese's peanut butter cup very lightly like the wrapper of the Reese's peanut butter cup so not the actual chocolate itself but like the wrapper so like the hint the remains of it so I pick up the peanut butter I kind of pick up I don't know if they have vanilla in every single candle I feel like I pick up vanilla in all Goose Creek candles but let me look up the scent notes it says peanut butter hot chocolate vanilla oh okay it has vanilla sugared cereal and powdered sugar okay so i'm not tripping there is vanilla in all these ones that i am picking up but very much smell like a faint of peanut butter and vanilla Ooh, coconut cream bath and body works last year the bake shop collection they did release coconut cream pie so i picked this one up to do a versus so this one is just coconut cream and let's see totally different totally different I pick up coconut cream. Wow, hold on. I feel like this is a more authentic coconut cream smell. It's not as strong as Bath & Body Works. Absolutely not. Imagine if a Bath & Body Works is 100, imagine this is like a 30. It's really low. But like I said, I keep saying this, but Goose Creek, you have to like them for the smell they do. It does come out. I smell coconut cream, to be honest. I smell like, you know, when you open a can of coconut, milk or coconut cream that's literally what this smells like let me look at the scent notes there's creamy ice cream coconut cream sugar and vanilla Ooh, what is this? pink berry crisps so i'm assuming this is something strawberry related oh this one's cracked also oh. can you see the crack yeah oh oh this smells like strawberries you know what this kind of reminds me of Imagine if you eat a strawberry cereal and the milk at the bottom. Strawberry milk. That's what I meant to say. It smells like strawberry milk. Strawberry pound cake. 
Oh, I think I picked this one up to go in competition with Strawberry Pound Cake. Spoiler alert, they smell nothing alike. So this is Strawberry Pound Cake, Red Berries, Milk, Vanilla, and Powdered Sugar. Yep, I picked this one to go ahead with Strawberry Pound Cake because the set note literally says Strawberry Pound Cake. It smells nothing like Bath & Body Works Strawberry Pound Cake. I will throw this out there, but this smells good. It smells like strawberry milk. Do you guys see the theme? I feel like I just got all cake stuff. Or maybe it's Goose Creek's fault that they only put out cake stuff. I don't know. Baking a cake. Let's see. Ooh. This smells different. I smell like a vanilla cream cake batter. I'm kind of getting like a twang in it. There's a twang in here. What the heck is a twang? Hold on. It says vanilla cake, buttercream, vanilla... No, so there is no twang. The twang is meat. It just smells... No, there's a twang in here. I don't know what it is. <coughs> I told you there's a twang in here. And my nostrils are clean now because I just sneezed. My senses are clean. It smells like a berry, berry cake. I like it. Mm, ooh, what is this? Strawberry shortcake. Ooh, is this also another one for st um, strawberry pound cake? Ooh, let's see. Ah, oh, this one's broken also. Ooh, this smells. Is this strawberry ice cream? Oh, strawberry shortcake. It smells strawberry. It smells like ice cream. It smells like strawberry ice cream. Definitely pick up cream, vanilla, and strawberry. The scent notes are ice cream, pink strawberries, and vanilla shortcake. Very spot on. Because I do know you do have to light them up and the smell does fill up your room. A couple of the Goose Creek candles I personally have lit, they have fully, fully, fully lit up, um, smelled my whole entire room. So I'm not judging them off of cold, but let's, I'm going to now go inside of my collection and see what I can pull up to compare with Goose Creek. I'll be right back. It's going to take me a minute. I have this peanut butter crisp one burning for about maybe 10 minutes. I mean, look, it's not, it hasn't even reached the outer edge and my entire room smells like peanut butter. My entire room smells like peanut butter. I'm telling you, don't judge Goose Creek based off cold. Make sure to warm them up. I'm back, guys. Am I confident? No. Like I said, a disclaimer. Um. I tried my best to match it up. In my head, this was executed perfectly. <laughs> In person, not so much. I tried the best that I could to find matching pairs. Again, I tried. I do have all the bath, almost all the Bath and Body Work candles. I have them all. I just couldn't find matching stuff. Like, If you guys have ideas, let me know in comments below which ones would match up, which Bath and Body Works candles would match up with the Goose Creek ones. Let me know. Um, let me just go with the first one. The key lime cake pie. What? The key lime cake pop. This one I bought with the intentions of matching it up with the Bath and Body Works key lime pie. However, I did finish that one. So the closest one I could find was lemon cake pop. So they're both cake pop. One is lime, one is lemon. You know, I thought close enough. So let me see first with. Ah, you guys, this smells so good. It smells like key lime pie. I know the description didn't say graham cracker, but I smell the graham cracker and it's cake pop. So it's supposed to be, you know, key lime cake pop, not graham cracker, but I smell the graham cracker. Very limey, very like sweet. I love this scent, guys. I absolutely love this scent. A plus. So this definitely smells it. Ah. Nope. Nope. Not comparison. I will say, head to head, I'll choose Goose Creek over the lemon. I thought I loved the lemon lemon cake pop, but key lime pie, key lime. You know what? I'm just gonna butcher the names, and we're gonna have to deal with it. I'm I'm done correcting myself. I definitely choose key lime pie over the lemon cake pop. This one, I don't know. I don't know what it is. But when it goes head to head, Goose Creek wins this round. Goose Creek 100,000% wins this round. And I do like this one. I bought a backup of it, but Goose Creek wins this round. And the cake pops, Goose Creek wins. I couldn't mess this one up. They're both the same thing, right? Coconut cream pie, coconut cream. 
right i did it so let's see bath and body works very it is coconut cream pie but i think it's like the caramel and the graham cracker to me and my nostrils that overtakes the smell so very much a coconut graham cracker caramel yeah thanks mm. i've said this before i'll say it again absolutely hands down bath and body works scents are always stronger on cold on cold bath and body works 10 out of 10 every single time will beat out goose creek at cold Goose Creek, you do need to light them up for them to take over the room. Off cold, I, I keep saying this, so guys, please, please, please keep that in mind when you're purchasing from Goose Creek. On cold, the scents are very light. You do have to light them up, okay, guys? I feel like this is a more authentic coconut cream smell. This is definitely, I feel like this is less like artificial smell. It's cleaner. I definitely, this one to me smells more like a can of coconut cream with some sugar and some vanilla. Like this smells like the custard. To me, this smells like the custard of actual coconut cream. Cream, delicious. It smells delicious, guys. And the coconut cream pie smells like the whole pie. You know, like the warmth, the graham cracker, the, you know. You know what? I can't believe I'm saying this, but I think Goose Creek wins this round too think because the bath and body works one i think they're just mind you i do like this smell so i'm not saying it's bad i own it for a reason i love it i i love this smell but up against the goose creek one this one is just more like light more natural smelling and this one definitely smells more artificial next to each other now mind you if goose creek wasn't here i love this smell i thought this smelled amazing i have backups of it but now next to this it smells more artificial so I feel like for this round also, I'm going to give it to Goose Creek's Ice Cream Coconut Cream. I think I prefer this one also. So, so far it's two for Goose Creek and zero for Bath & Body Works, which is blowing my mind. But I know Bath & Body Works is going to win. Come on, let's be real. Are they? I don't know. This one I tried, guys. Bath & Body Works does not have a lot of banana smells, so I tried. They do have the one they just released for the summer, which was like passion fruit bananas passion flower something something like that but i felt like this one was more um equipped to go together so this is banana cabana and this is banana marshmallow i am fully aware that they are not the same scent guys i'm, I'm not going to keep giving this disclaimer i'm fully aware however Banana scents are very rare at Bath & Body Works. So it was between Banana Cabana and the Banana Flower stuff. And I decided to go with Banana Cabana because I personally enjoy this smell more. I think it smells more authentic banana than the one that just came out. So this is Banana Cabana and this is Ice Cream and Banana Marshmallow. Ah, oh, I love it. it. Is Banana it smells just like banana i smell a hint of vanilla it's sweet is there a vanilla in here sunkissed banana sea spray warm vanilla yeah there is vanilla in here it's a very true to banana smell to me i love this one um if you ever see it pick it up this one is banana marshmallow Ooh, you know what it's so hard to put these against each other because that one is just a banana fight in by itself and this one has banana and marshmallow teaming up together so to compare the two banana cabana smells like banana how many times have i said banana it smells like banana right this smells like a banana split so you smell an ice cream you smell sugar you smell marshmallow so this one i feel like it's a little unfair to put them two against each other but like i said there's i don't have any other options so it is what it is oh this smells really good guys this smells really good it smells like a banana split i'm telling you that marshmallow comes through that ice cream comes through it smells really really good it smells very sweet but i think this one i will give it to bath and body works just because this is more like a authentic true to self smell this one again is has help, you know, it has the marshmallows helping her. It has the sugar helping her. 
but I think for this one, I'm gonna give it to Banana Cabana. This is the candle that gave me the idea to do it. Strawberry pound cake, guys. Um, I was too lazy to look for the recent packaging. This packaging is the one from 2019, so it is what it is. I was too lazy to look for it. So this is strawberry pound cake. This is pink berry crisps. However, the scent notes for this literally says strawberry pound cake. So I was like, strawberry pound cake is one of my favorite smells. I'm actually, there you go. There's the new packaging. I'm burning the new packaging right now. That candle's almost done. Oh, strawberry pound cake. What can I say about her? She's Grammy. She's crackery. She's poundy. <laughs> she's strawberry. Smells like an all together wrapped up warmth. Going to your grandma's house. My grandma didn't bake, but it smells like going to your grandma's house and her handing you a slice of strawberry pound cake. I love strawberry pound cake. I cannot see the other candle beating it out, but I'm going to keep my mind open. Actually, I just realized I actually have two in competition because this one is strawberry shortcake. This one is the strawberry pound cake. So let's see. This is you can't beat strawberry pound cake it smells good i smell strawberries this is again more i would say authentic to strawberries it doesn't have that graham cracker it doesn't have that warmth that strawberry pound cake has this is more just i would say fresher strawberry smell it doesn't have the other like it doesn't have the de depth that strawberry pound cake has still a great smell but no way in heck is it beating out um strawberry pound cake this is i think i said it earlier it's more like a strawberry milk type of smell a strawberry shortcake nope it's not a bad smell it just i'm just saying nope they can't compete nope they can't come in the club mm -mm. strawberry pound cake all the way strawberry pound cake all the way and these two i tried i tried it's ice cream bar from Bath and Body Works and birthday cake from their ice cream collection at Goose Creek. And the reason, I know it sounds weird. This is ice cream and this is birthday cake. Why am I putting it together? Because this is ice cream and the, no the note for this is literally ice cream cake. So let's just ignore the birthday part. <laughs> That's how we do it here, okay? So this is just ice cream cake and this is ice cream bar. Again, I know they don't match, but it's the closest I can get. Ice cream bar from Bath & Body Works. What is that? Oh, wafer. I was gonna say, it smells like warm. So the first scent note I get is the wafer or the waffle, whatever. Um, so it's chocolate wafer, vanilla ice cream, graham cracker. So this isn't what I was kind of thinking. This is more of a warm smell. I'm definitely picking up the graham cracker. I'm definitely picking up the, what is it, the wafer. So instead of ice cream bar, I would definitely say it's more of like a crust smell, like graham cracker crust, like that type of smell. It's not really like an ice cream smell to me. It smells great. I love this smell. I love it. But I'm just saying compared to like, you know, the other one. So it's less of an ice cream smell, more of a graham cracker smell to me. It smells delicious though. Ooh, let's see, birthday cake. Ooh. So this one definitely, I feel like this one smells more like ice cream than ice cream bar. This doesn't have the distraction of the graham cracker. This doesn't have the distraction of the um, wafer. This one smells more authentic to ice cream. It just smells like vanilla ice cream. Between these two, ooh, it's tough. I don't know. I don't know who I would give it to because, again, this is more graham cracker. This is more pure ice cream. You guys, this is a toss-up. I'm not sure who to give it to. Packaging is cuter on this one. The name is more accurate on this one. Because, see, this one they wrote ice cream bar, but no. An ice cream bar would smell like ice cream, not like wafers. That's not ice cream bar. That's ice cream cone. I think this one I'll give it to Goose Creek, guys. I think I'm gonna give it to Goose Creek only because, again, I love the smell, but this is just more authentic to the packaging, to the label. I think I'll give this one to Goose Creek, yeah. I think that's it for now, guys. Um, I was getting tired of trying to match up smells because I was just, it's so hard to match up smells when, you know, they're not dupes, they're not identical. Uh, I tried, but yeah, guys, I tried. <laughs> Thank you so much. If you guys like this video, let me know. If you guys have ideas for matching stuff, I'll be more than happy to compare them to each other. 
But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. It was kind of fun for me to film. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye!